Hey guys, thanks for clicking on the uh, video and being willing to help me. Um, very new to this game and the forums, but I just have something to say about that and just that uh, I'm very impressed by the amount of help that you know the community offers and how awesome the forums are and everything. So <laughs> just wanted to say that. Um, but anyway, I'm super new to the game, uh, and I'm very new to real navigation, and I just downloaded Wolves of Steel, uh, so I should mention that there's no other extra mods in this, just the Wolves of Steel pack with the real navigation that was included in the mod pack. Uh, I do want to say I really love the grittiness of it, <laughs> the water being dark and not tropical, uh, which seems to be appropriate for Europe or in the Atlantic. Anyway, so my problem is I can't identify targets. So <clears throat> let me just show you. So I have this uh, locked on, as you can see. Uh, so I did that, um, and when I use the the gun officer and a torpedo attack, uh, I think usually I would see videos in the past that would say identify the target. I guess this is hard mode or you know super realistic. So it gives you the bearing I guess, uh, the solution. It, I pressed it a few moments ago and it gave me this. Uh, so the, bear, the bearing is correct, um, the range is obviously not, and I'm just going to pause this to avoid the sound. So it says, I have a warship. Now I need to identify it, right? So <clears throat> I'll go into this. Now this chart looks different than ones I've seen on old videos as well. Uh, usually there would be a book where you could click on the type of ship and then send it to TDC. This one's a little bit different and I think it is like more hardcore and I really love all these charts. Uh, and I actually like this better because it's more challenging but the thing is so I go to warships and you know I can't s click on anything obviously um, I'm sure s a lot of you know what this is so I'm just gonna go ahead I identified this sh particular ship as this if I'm not mistaken uh, but that's besides the point so the mast is 45 meters high so I would like to give this information uh, to my XO here. Click to open or close the dialog box. See? It, I mean, where do I enter in the mass height and the type? That's my question. That's it. That's 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 all I have. I mean, I just need the type because I, what I really need is the range. Um, if I can get the range, I can get the speed and I can get everything else. But the thing is, when I try to get the range, let's line it up. You can probably understand my frustration. Okay, it's not locked on, so let's let's do that. I'm going to take a step back just to make sure. I think it is locked on, but it's because it's paused. Okay, so uh, I have it lined up now. All right, use the stati meter. What, however you pronounce it, uh, and then click on this, right? And then top of the flag, always 20,000 meters or two kilometers. Uh, watch, when I click on this button up here, it changes automatically to 20,000 no matter what. If I move it around, it won't fluctuate. It just stays at 20,000 meters. So the reason that it says scroll, uh, scroll mouse wheel, I don't, that doesn't do any. It doesn't. It mo scrolls the the zoom. That doesn't help me though. So I think what my understanding is that the reason this is not working is because I haven't identified the ship. So that's the root of the problem, I believe. Again, I'm super new to all this, and I'm not sure. But if you guys have a solution, I would greatly appreciate it. I pl probably put in at least 10 hours of probably more like 15 hours in the past couple of days just learning the game and everything and you can imagine my frustration when I can't 
fire a torpedo. <laughs> because I can't get the correct uh, solution to the target. So please, please help me, okay? <laughs> I would really appreciate it. Okay, thank you.